Welcome to the Empire, this is Rampane, and welcome back to my Legions of Nagash campaign. We're going to continue with that from last time, where I've taken out the Green Knight and the previous faction leader for the Bretonians, but they're still not dead. Uh, we are going to be starting to make our way over... Uh, he's right here. Yeah, this is the current heir, at least. So we can make our way over there and try and kill him. Let's kind of make our way up around this way. Build some watchtowers while we're doing this as well. Might as well, might as well while we're going through. So we're going to keep making Nagash make his way over here. They do have some Come land around here. Me, uh, do I have a spy around here still? Yes, I do. Okay, so I'll have you. Let's try and have you kind of scout ahead of Nagash around here. We're going to just abandon this city here. I've already destroyed everything that matters for me. Uh, it doesn't matter for me that that city. So we'll just let them take it back again. As I'll just be able to conquer it once it's turned to rebel. Um, let's have you... Go around over and keep looking through some of these areas. Because I think almost every single one of you are just generals. I don't see anybody else in the family tree. Yeah, just another general. So let's have you kind of group up over this way. Kind of go around there to try and find them. Still trying to kill off Astalia, which should just be you. As soon as I get Arkin over here, we'll be able to for sure guarantee that you die. Which is uh, pretty soon, actually. You guys, are you limiting my movement right now? They are. Okay, so next turn, I can drop you off around here, start that siege, and I'm fairly certain they don't have any other family members. So I should be able to very easily kill off Astalia for sure today. Bretonia, I can very easily get over here and kill you. That's not hard. I don't know where their faction leader is right now. We, we have to find him. If we find him, Bretonia can die today as well. But if I don't, then... That's going to be annoying. Uh, let's go around again and kind of queue up some buildings around here. Also, these might actually still work and actually give me um, money. It's just in this mod, I forgot that they have it set up so that you gain... Um, it depends on the winter how much these give you. So I'm going to try and build them, actually. I'm going to try and build the crop rotations and see if they fucking help. I don't think they will because it just says average harvest 153, but it does have something here even though this has nothing. So we'll we'll try that. We'll try and upgrade these and see if it's gonna do anything. Like, why not? If it actually does and I actually get some more money, perfect. If it doesn't, then uh, okay, it's a waste of money, and we just make sure we never build it ever again. But if we do notice a uh, steady increase in my income because of this, sure. So let's try that. Just try and get a bunch of these all over the place. Do keep getting more of the trade buildings because those are a bit better for us. Uh, Bergvaria yeah, slave market. That do you have? You do have a port. Then the better mausoleum and the competition. Around here, grab all of those. Boom and boom. You can get the better town hall around there. You're more time. I need to keep just building up the defenses around here primarily. I need to make sure they don't have a chance to easy break take that down. Uh, sepulcher there. It's gonna keep that, that, and that. Boom, boom, boom. And I'm almost out of money now at this point. Keep that, that. Oh, that's all down. And get like one more thing. Uh, oh, actually, I still don't have this. Well, it doesn't really matter too much for us. Let's get the better mayor's pals. Uh, mm, actually, wait. I need to make sure. Over here. Yeah, get, get more assassins. Get more assassins around here and here. And then I think I should still have you continue recruiting more units around here. Because next turn uh, depends on this army. If this army goes next to the city, I might be able to guarantee. Oh, actually, we do have. Welcome. Now, damn. I was hoping I maybe decided to grab a catapult, but I did not there. Okay, up here, let's go check on you guys around here again. <laughs> uh, you do have some units, so you should be okay. Where did uh, that other general of mine go around here? Because I need to try and take this city back. So we're trying to gather a force together for him. Where'd he go? First he is somewhere. Oh, here he is. These He's like nothing. Uh, try and make your way over here. We're going to try and gather a force for you. Neferata should be right around here. Yeah, no, here she is. So Neferata, let us... Uh, Tempelhof, we can easily take that. So let's just start sieging around here to take this out. I'll have to make sure I did actually fight the battle myself, because I really don't like losing my units like that. So we'll take Tempelhof. Uh, probably Waldenhof after that. Keep securing our position around here. Um, Averheim, around here, because I know they've got another city around here. Um, I think it's a dwarven somewhere around here. Let's grab all of you. Make your way down this way. Get some more of the skeletons. And let's try and go right about here. The watchtower, and there's more zombies. Because I think there's, there's some city around here. So let's try and make your way over there. Try and take that. 
please ignore me in all these other cities. I don't want to, like, this area here, I'll probably lose. This one will be fine. That one I'm not sieged. This one I'm sieged. Uh, this one might be okay. And then if you guys finally ignored me around here. Yeah, it looks like you finally have. I'm going to try and merge this army together if I can a little bit more. Oh. Not what I meant to do, but okay. I meant to put these armies together, uh, but that should work still. Okay, so they're going to try and attack us at Vardanos. Let's see if we can hold here. I cannot remember if this is a castle and or a city, but we will give it our damn best. Ah, yes, it is a city. Okay, so what we're going to do, last time this worked out rather well. If I can get everybody off the walls initially, put my general's bodyguard up here with some of you, I do need to send out at least two units, maybe just one, uh, to try and harass them. Let's try it. So if I kind of just do this, if I just have it be spread out, it'd be kind of thin, just put it in front of the ram and the siege tower. More than likely, you guys always stop. Oh, please shut the gates. There you go. That should be good enough to get them to stop uh, using these pieces. And then we just have to focus on just the ladder. As long as they go to just the ladder, we should be good. <sighs> Lost my general, but we were able to kill about half of their army uh, and delay their advance. They have a bunch of calves, so I was only able to kill all the infantry. But hey, that's fine. I will be able to try and send another general over here to help out. <laughs> Five kills, not bad. As long as he can keep that up, as long as we have one general for sure to try and help out on the walls, I should be okay here. We just need to buy some time, as I literally just need a turn or two. Then, Estalia should be dead. Unless they have one, unless just like the Bretonians, they have a random general somewhere. I hope that's not the case. As I've so far checked every city of theirs, and I haven't seen anybody. Britonia is larger than them, so I'm not surprised they have another family member. Oh, yeah, I forgot I was saving that money for the, um... Ah, let's see, some, some civil disorder, Caron. They didn't take it, what? Why? Okay, well, I'm going to ignore that. More time. This area, I'm not surprised they're upset like that. It's primarily conversion. We just need to continue to convert it. So just keep building up the graveyards. Keep doing that. I will get some more units around here to fill up the garrison. Do that. And then let's have... Let's see. I'm going to first have this spy scout around here. So I don't really have a updated information for this area. So it's kind of... Oh, not you. That's what I was trying to do. I was trying to check out this city here. Keep going around there. Oh, whoa, whoa. Who was that? That had command. That had command. Who the fuck was that? <gasps> kill him! Fucking kill him! Fucking kill him! Fucking kill him! There we go. Okay, I found the other one. Galahad. Okay, so as long as I don't lose track of the other general, Bretonia should die. Please don't have another family member after these two. Why was he up here? Okay, so he was just randomly in other lands that he didn't even belong to. Like they have some land in the east, so I'm not too surprised that the heir is there. But this guy, what the fuck, man? Okay, so let's just rush in here, murder him as quickly as possible. I want to guarantee he dies, so giants, make your way on in there. Uh, I'll have my Nephrod's handy and bodyguard kind of run along this way. Nagash, kind of go back again. All of you kind of chill right there, and my calf right over here. So get on in there, guys. I can see it in sight. The end of this campaign is almost here. We just have to kill you. Then I hope that, uh, just instantly breaking, nice. Uh, I'll hope that I'm able to get uh, over to the faction heir, the current faction heir, uh, before too long? Before they have another chance to get another general? I hope so, at least. Uh, and if I was handing bodyguard, what are you fucking doing? Knights of the Realm. Come on, finish them off. Don't want them to run over to you. A uh, third of their army's already dead. The general is not dead yet. Come on, kill him. Is that it? Where is he? No, he's still alive somewhere. I'm sort of spreading out my giants a little bit. I'm sort of having you kind of spread out, sort of trying to hit some of the other units that they have in melee combat with us. As the moment, for the most part, I have most of their army team. Oh, there he is. Yeah, Knights of the Realm Bodyguard. Don't forget to finish him off. Because number wise, half the army's dead. Just kill him and everybody should break. If I was him, I need bodyguard. Let's have you kind of go over this way a little bit. All my giants are fighting something. Where's the general? Where'd the sneaky bastard go? Oh no, he's here. Yeah, please hit him with uh, magic again. There you go. Okay, so there goes the current faction leader, Royach Galahad. He's now out of the picture. 
Now we just need to finish off the rest of this force. Some Talbert men, some peasant bowmen. Trying over there. And who else is there? Like nobody at this point? They've lost 73% of their army already. Okay, so now we've cleared him out. Another faction leader is out of the way. I have to hope now, because it's probably going to take me, um, how many turns will it take for me to get over to that faction leader now? Because I'm ignoring all cities, I don't think it should take that long. Maybe two, three turns, and we'll be able to get over there and kill him. I think that seems reasonable. Let's see how much movement I've left out of this. Oh, he's dead. Um... Keep pushing about. We've got some more undead dudes I can grab if I want, but I'm not going to. So let's see. He what the fuck? Why are you way over here? Okay, so do the same thing again. So I'm going to keep using up all my movement. There we go. Then like this. So you can kind of just keep an eye on where the hell he is. Like they have no land over here and you just are all the way over here. Oh man, this is gonna take forever to get over there, there with the gash. The this world to it's like four or five turns away, actually. Damn. <sighs> but we do know where he is now. We now have another chance. Let's see if you guys can take these guys out. Also, actually, wait before I forget. Because let's use all the crappy assassins first. And then, uh, where is my assassin that actually has stuff? Yeah, you've got the prototype one. Because uh, you're the one. Is this one right? Yes, yeah, so let's try you. Can I not transfer that over? Damn, I was hoping you could. Okay, we'll try with everybody else first, though. Try and see if we can assassinate you. Come on. No. Yes! Are they dead? They're not dead. They are not dead. They are not fucking dead. See you dead. In my Where the head. fuck? You want us gone? Then like do two steps well, forward. Wait, well, one step forward, two steps back. Go, As what the fuck? General. General. <laughs> what the? F Where? Where is this pompous son of a bitch? Where is your other family member? We will not surrender. I swear to God. Name the field of battle. Oh, come on. Like, you've got to be fucking kidding me. Master. Who is it? Who? Who is your current faction leader now? It's none of these guys. Oh, my God. Okay, spread out. Everybody spread out. we got to figure out where the fuck this bastard is. Bringing Arkin over here now is not going to do anything. Um, because we got some there, there, there. Uh, let's bring you up this way. Skaven Blight. Just, just says General. Okay. Uh, drop off here. And well, we're going to do this at least. I'm going to take this. Oh, wait. Oh, no, sorry. I always feel like that's going to be their general's uh, bodyguard unit that they have on the back campaign map, but no, it's not. So we'll take this. We'll start conquering some land around here, I guess, until I can figure out where the fuck there's uh, the general is. Uh, okay. I'll just start moving more of my spies, keep spreading them out around here, and we'll, we'll find him. We'll find him. I need to make sure I keep getting more spies and assassins around over here and here. Uh, yeah, just get the assassin primarily. Focus on that. Because where the fuck else? We will see you dead. Name the field of battle. Who else could it be? Like, the land they have is just around here. Um, this is an assassin. General. Let's check around these areas. No, no. Just says general. Okay. Because you have. How much land do you have? Territorially, they've got like, what, 16 regions? Where the hell? Okay. We'll just figure it out. I've got plenty of assassins. I've got plenty of spies. 
Master. I'll keep, I'm just gonna put one next to every single city they control, and I'm gonna figure out where the hell he is. Uh, let's send one of you guys over here to watch over that city. I am recruiting some more guys, so that should be okay. Keep moving over that way. I have a scout around here. Let's kind of bring you up this way. I need to keep an eye on every single they control. So I have a spy there. Let me make sure I'm using all my spies. Because you're already moving. You're already moving. You're, st you're in position. Uh, you uh, make your way back over here. Because we want to check out Karak Izor. Nope, nothing in there. Okay. Uh, good, good, good. Oh, actually, no, not you need to move. Uh, make your way up here. Again, we need to start moving around and check out every single city they own. You're good as you are until they're dead. You need to move just a little bit closer. You're still moving forward. You need to make your way up this way as well. Actually, there's just plenty of, There's a lot of spies over here. You stay there. Watch over that spot. Because where else could they be? I have plenty of scouts around here, so we just need to keep moving past here and figure out where they are. Oh, that blew the... Okay. Literally, it's like I'm getting so close to killing these guys off here and so far away, like Bretonia. I just need to get to that one other family member and I think they should be dead. That's all I need. So, uh, so Nagash will be continuing to make his way over there. Hopefully they don't get anybody else in time. That's my Just going back over to Seekor. Try and train those guys if you can. And then uh, Neferata, at least now. Uh, I need to have you... Ooh, actually, this guy. Uh, live this siege, actually. And hit this guy. Ah, I was hoping you guys would actually let me lure you out of the city as opposed to having to push through it. So I guess I'll have to try again next turn. Um, I do need to try and have... You scouts keep going about here. This is an assassin or spy? That's an assassin. Ooh, 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 ooh. You have a 6% chance. Go over there and try and see if you can stab him. Because, okay, actually, one thing I should make sure to do. Let me double check how many cities they have here. So, one, two, three, um, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, fourteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. That because to be eighteen. That kind of lines up. That might actually be a little bit off on what I'm seeing here, but no, I think that makes sense. Them having eighteen, so that adds up. It's just the question is where the hell is the other family member? Ah, uh, you guys are trying Catherine again. Let's see this army here. Not the worst. Might have a chance. This is a multiple layered castle, so I think we hold up just at the gates again. We might be able to hold them at bay. Although, please, please let me actually keep most of my army this time. Yeah, as long as you don't have too much, this actually can hold out decently well. We've taken out about almost half the army now. Only have lost a third of our own. I need to take out whoever their captain is. As long as he dies, we might, we should be able to hold this. Although, please just, I, I, again, I need to have some of my men survive. There we go! Okay, you guys were able to hold for a little bit longer. That's good. Maybe I'll actually have some time to properly get some reinforcements around here for Carrot Cadron. Because I do not want to allow the Empire to just slowly push on in here towards Silver Pinnacle. I'm already having enough troubles up here because of the damn uh, Chaos Forces. I can't have the Empire up here too. At least right now with the Empire, I have Neferata trying to harass them and start trying to build up a force down around there. Which hopefully... Fuck you guys. I was hoping it might give me a turn to get some more men in there, but no, Carrot Cadron's never. I desperately need to get the forces over into... Oh, hello! This is a bad idea for you guys. Let's see. Uh... Oh, shit! <laughs> okay, Emperor Karl Franz is here. I was about to say, like, why are you attacking me? It would be hilarious. <laughs> I highly doubt this. Because I'm assuming the Empire has to have at least another family member or two still before they die. But imagine! <laughs> Just imagine! With me for a second. The Emperor, Ka Emperor Karl Franz dies here today just because of Neferata. That'd be amazing and just kills off the Empire. Oh, that'd be great. 
Because literally, then I just need to kill Bretonia, which is coming. And then I just need to capture all the land we need. And this campaign will be done. But oh my god, I love this. Because Neferatus Hame and your bodyguard grab all of you. We want to make sure, since they're going to be coming to us. There's not that many of them. But I want to try and make sure we make the most out of our skirmishers. Um, let's go over here. This is a decent hill right here. Let's go right there. And then all of my cav units and my infantry. Let's grip you on up here. I want them to try and attack us initially here. And then we'll try and have Neferod's hand and bodyguard unload on them as soon as they're grouped up. So let's kind of hold off on... Oh! Well, that's one way to deal with it. I didn't realize that you guys were reinforcing from right there. So, uh, Emperor Karl Franz is right. Yep, he's in the back. Okay, Neferod's hand and bodyguard just unload on them. This is the main army we're actually caring about, so let's move all of my units over this way. Because if you guys get through, uh, this is the issue. So, unload. We can't shoot the Emperor just yet. Not until he's on the map. Focus that cannon. Fucking focus that cannon, please. Come on, kill the cannon. Then focus on the Griffins. Come on, come on, come on. Let's try and back you off a little bit. Run away from the melee infantry. Enemy general is dead, yeah! Emperor Call of Friends is now out of the picture. I highly doubt that we're gonna kill the Empire immediately like that, but I would fucking love if that was the case. Okay, uh, ceasefire. Don't waste all your ammo. Uh, I wanna be able to hit these guys up here a little bit first, too. We dealt pretty much a decisive blow against Call of Friends. This was kind of rude up here. Uh, that's some of the circle in the night. Let's have Neferata kind of run around this way. Kind of ignore that one. If you have ammo, shoot it. Do some of you not? Some of you still have ammo. Oh, oh I accidentally turned all of you off. Okay, unload on them there. Oh, just shoot the Empire Swordsman there. They're dead. You guys should be able to very easily deal with that one cab unit. It is now dead too. Okay. End the battle there. Now the question is, does the Empire just die from this? I'm waiting with anticipation because it's possible. With how fucked up the family trees are in this campaign, literally the Empire might just die. They have not been doing that well for themselves. And I've now just killed the Carl's friends. Let's see. Come on, come on, come on. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Nothing can hide from Damn it! Got my hopes up. Got my hopes up that that might have uh, done them in. Oh. I think you guys are making your way over here. Ah, uh, this area here. Please leave me the fuck. I don't wanna. Why are you so dead set on killing me here? I don't care about you. Just, just all resolve this. It doesn't matter. Like, I, that's an area that I don't wanna fight. Like, take the city if you want. I'm focusing on trying to kill you. And so we can d worry about that later. I still have to figure out where their damn family members are. Because I've taken out the faction leader and the heir. They've either got one to two generals that is still on the family tree. They could be on a boat. Which, if that's the case, shit. If they're not on a boat, then I expect them to maybe kind of be in the northeastern area. That's my expectation. Because I've, I've checked, like, every city. Oh, wait, no. The one in southern Bretonia, I don't think I've properly checked. Right? No, I don't think so. So if they're going to have anybody, I think... Yeah, I know. Um, I think they'll be over here. So let's see. Yeah, let's have you go check this area first. No, nobody there. So they have no more land around here. Check out Skate and Blight. She says General. Around here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That's the faction heir. Okay. I found the faction heir. Now the question is... Where is the faction leader? Try and stab this bastard. 36% chance. You can do it. Keep trying to stab him. Okay. So we now know where somebody is. Uh, honestly, like, I don't really care about these areas. Because there's little, there's nobody over here. I can take this land, but actually, uh, let's lift the siege, just ignore this. Make my way back over this way. Let's kind of scout around the coast just in case. If anybody else. Nobody. Nobody. Okay. I'm gonna make my way over. I know where their heir is, so I can kill you. That might mean the family member, the faction leader might be here. I, I don't think I've checked out this area. 
Oh no, here he is! Okay, faction leader, faction heir. Okay, yeah, we have to. Does his name fucking say Jesus? Pontiff Jesus. Yes. Okay. So, we need to bring uh, Arkin back over this way. I need to keep an eye on you two, so I'm gonna kind of do the same thing I've done before, just so I can kind of keep an eye on where you two are. You. Do the same thing with this faction leader of theirs. Kind of keep walking back and forth until you have no movement, and then I'll have it so you do another order, and you'll just follow him. Right there, there, there. Okay. So now just keep an eye on him. Keep an eye on him. Keep following him. Uh, let's see. Okay, I just want to check these jumps every once in a while. So this. Did I lose track of him? Nope, you're still there. Okay, so do the same thing. Keep following this guy. Yeah, keep following him. I do have a chance to kill him. Eh? No, of course not. Okay. Gash. Okay, so we need to make our way through here. I have to go down this way. Slowly make my way over to him. Two more turns until I can get over to him. I'm gonna hope again that they have nobody else. This is not under their control, so I don't have to worry about that. I just need to keep an eye on you. And I'm wondering, I need to make sure I keep an eye out in these other cities of theirs. Just to try and see where else they might have family members that matter. So let's have you kind of check around here. Nobody there. Um, this is Empire. Let's check on up here. Oh, I can't see there. I can't see there. I can't get past you right now. So just kind of chill around here. We'll check this city right here. I want to check this area. Tabaheim. Because they might have somebody around there, possibly. Other than that, I think it is literally just... We'll still have all of you spread out. So have you keep making your way forward. I want to make sure I have one spy on every city they own. Just to guarantee that they have nobody else that could be their family members. Because these are just all generals. Scout, so you can just... Uh, you go... Stay by Skaven Blight. Go over there. And then I need to have one of you stay around here. I've got one to stay right around here. And then I think that's most of their cities besides the ones over here. So all of you go over towards Skaven Blight. Then I'll have one person on every one of their cities. But I think we might be able to kill them both today. I just need to get Arkin over here and fight those battles. Battle-wise, I do need um, back over here. Templewolf. So Nefarada. Let's attack this city. It's properly just assaulted myself. Let's do night battle so that we don't have to worry about everybody else. I can't auto-resolve, otherwise I'll lose my Nefarada's handmade bodyguards. I'll just push on in here. Take this. Keep clearing this area away. And then I really need to make sure, after uh, Estalia, because I'm fairly certain that for the most part, Bretonia just has this one family member left, we'll send all my spies that Estalia has right now, after I kill them, to go on into the Empire and start trying to figure out where they have their family members. Because, yeah, we killed Emperor Carl's friends. That's the hard part. He's now dead. That's, like, their guaranteed original faction leader. Um, the other faction leaders I could possibly see is uh, Gelt. Uh, he could be another person they possibly have. Who else could they have for other f uh, generals they might actually have as, like, faction leaders or faction heirs? I can't remember, because I've never played the Empire as much in, like, the Warhammer Total War games. Um, I need to do that as soon as Mortal Empires comes out for, import, uh, for Warhammer 3. I am so doing a World Conquest as the Empire, because I think that'll be fun as hell. Although I'm glad in Warhammer 3. The Empire should be able to put more of a fight to my units than in this mod right now, because if I... I know I want to at some point, when version 3 of this mod comes out, eventually. I want to try and do a World Conquest of the Reichland in that as well. But, oh man, does, does the Empire even have any really good units that are monstrous? Because I know I've been taking advantage of giants and troll-like units like the Crypt Cryptors. But I don't think the Empire has anything like that, actually. I don't think they do. I know they have the steam tanks, but I can't remember if the steam tanks are all that tanky. I don't think they actually are. I think they're just kind of mobile artillery. By the way, Templehof is now under auto control. I'll exterminate that populace. And then I need to repair everything. Let me get rid of all of the excess random buildings now. Okay. There we go. So now let me just make sure I keep getting the Sepulchre. Uh, I can recruit a little bit around here, not a ton. Uh, let's make sure we have a full stack army in here, or at least just some dudes to watch over the settlement before we leave. So keep sending some stuff up to the Drakenhof. We'll keep trying to retrain around here, but have Zeus Bad. Let's have you get some more units, just general units. 
because I want to make sure we have plenty of garrison forces around here so we can keep pushing with Neferata. Let's give you more generals and more skeleton warriors around there, there, there. Um, up here, please don't siege us here. Please don't siege us here because I'm not ready around there. I'm trying to get Cadron sieged Silver Pinnacle. You're trying to get some Banshees. I need you to get some more... Because I've got, like, these there guys. Not the strength in this world. That's what I've got for an army. Um, I've got some stuff down here. I can basically just grab all of you. So I have some fodder. So there's some fodder. And then I need you to keep getting... Ooh, yeah, get some more Krators. Get some Black Knights. And then I'll have you just get more skeletons just to garrison that area. You keep trying to get Pax Wraiths. And then try and get some Temple Guard. There's some Grave Guard. Try and grab some of them. See if there's some released. I can't know about that. Battle. Yes, we know. Okay, close all that down. All these are just recruitment reports and stuff. Now, let's see. Non Gash. You've already been moved. And I've performed her correctly. Yeah, well, okay. So, we'll keep trying to see if we can get to their faction, their faction leader around here sooner rather than later with Nagash and Ankin. Because I think we can still kill them today. Oh, man. I hate that you guys are taking... You're going to take Seepcore. I can't stop you. I have to have an actual army come up there to try and stop you. I cannot do this. That's just a generic jump, too. So we'll just have to auto-resolve that. They'll be able to take it back. I need to try and get... Wait, why is Kislev Rebel? Do they never take Kislev? Huh. Um, For a moment there, I thought they captured that. I guess not. Because I'm hoping what we can try and do is around Templehof and everything are down here. I want to have it so Neferata can get them to be self-sufficient, self and she doesn't need to stay down here. So they can kind of keep pushing back against the Empire on their own. And then I need to bring her back. You guys are, ew, yeah, you guys are attacking Nostalia. Usually you guys don't actually expand navally, but I'm kind of glad you guys are. Ooh, I found a family member. This is a family member, so I'm, I'm going to fight this. Uh, it was around, because yeah, I did find the symbol of the Black Prince. You, I have to kill you, because if I don't, and I take out those two other family members with Akin, you would just become the next faction leader. So let's try and fight this and focus down the family member. If I can at least kill him, if I lose the army, that's fine, but if I at least I kill him, that's my goal. Because Arkin will be there next turn. He'll be able to drop off and start attacking them next turn. Pull back up here. Oh, that's no, kind of more downhill. Let's go up here. Yeah, this isn't that bad. So kind of go back over here. Group up all of my grave guard. Right there. Reinforce once right there. And then some more over here. Just kind of blob up. And I'll try and focus my general onto theirs. I should have checked what their general's bodyguard was again. But we'll try and see if we can take him out. Because we might be able to at least do a decent amount of damage to this army. But not be able to... Well, balance power is actually pretty even. If we hold here, we might be okay. They do have a lot of skirmishers, which is an issue. Okay, here they come. I'm going to actually have my forces start advancing towards them. They have a lot of skirmishers. I could just try and fight them in melee, but I don't think that's going to really do all that much. My general, I'm going to have you try and loop around and see if you can just hit their general specifically. He is this guy right here. The mercenary warband. So I'll try and focus you down with my general if I can. But my infantry just slowly move on up. Try and get into melee with their skirmishers if you can. Because I really need to make sure I can't just be shot at. So keep moving forward. Let's try and have you guys kind of rush on forward now. Kind of right there. Yeah. Start attacking! Go, go, go. There, there. 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 You're a little bit slower. Now the great guard. Push forward. General. Where did he go? He is... Here, he's in the back. So we want to try and make our way over to you. Keep moving these units forward. Keep the fight up. Otherwise, how are we doing? 3-3, uh, three, three, so pretty even right now. We'll have these units here. Try and flank the best you guys can. So there. The General's bodyguard. These are bandits. Okay, mercenary warband. That's what I care about. So you try and specifically run up to these units. Try and attack them in the rain in melee. There, there, there. Just bodyguard. Try and weave through there again. Because I need you to get to this mercenary warband. How are you doing? Uh, 12th. You're doing okay there. This unit, let's bring you around try and flank this unit. General, go for the mercenary warband. 
have to kill him. As long as you kill him, I don't care how many men we lose. Quarrelers are starting to fight us as well. No, they, they, they pull back. Yeah, keep them distracted. Keep these units distracted. Just have them run away endlessly for all I care. I just need a 1v1 with you and I can kill you. The little bastard wants to keep running away. They keep throwing other units at my general. I have him surrounded them this time. Uh, it's not with my best units, but maybe they can keep him distracted just long enough to get somebody else over here. Let's get you to hunt out there. Trying to move some of these units behind to flank them. Uh, these units were chasing people. Seems like they have ran off the map now. So let's get back over to my forces right here. How about the Thunderers? You are still chasing this unit. Yeah, keep that up. Keep chasing them. You are... Yeah, this blob's not doing much. I need to actually flank this unit at least. Keep focusing your attention on the Quarrelers. Because right now we're doing well number-wise. Two-thirds of their army have died. If we can get another third, or if we can just get the general to die, then the rest of them should break. Because he's down to 42 men. He's getting there. This unit now kind of go around. How about the Thunderer? Because they should break. Go up here. Surround the Quarrelers. There you go. I'm curious how these guys are still getting uh, Dwarven units with the Dwarves being dead. Do they have that as just like a mercenary unit? Kind of curious. It took him long enough. I had to surround you with my entire army to finally kill you, you bastard. Now, I just need to keep running them down and try and break whoever's still fighting. Because at this point, we've now won. We've killed their general. There's just a couple guys still thinking that they're going to win. I think it's maybe just this unit up here. Just this one. Oh, I was routing. There's a guy over here. That one's broken as well. Hmm, I don't know who it is. There we go. Okay, so that's another family member out of the way, just in case they became a uh, the heir or the faction leader. Hopefully not. Hopefully I'll have enough time to be able to get Arkin to just kill everybody I need to, so we don't have the problem with them having more family members, please. I really have to hope that Bretonia does not send that... Because I, I found him. Now Nagash just has to catch up to that son of a bitch before they get any other family members. Because I think Arkin can finish off Astalia, but I don't know if that's going to be today. Maybe, maybe not. We'll have to see. Ah, uh, not if you guys can attack me like this. Uh, Autosolf, can you win this? Like, honestly, it's, it's, it's just a bunch of spearmen. Eh? Yeah, nice. Thank you. I always appreciate when the Autosolf... Oh, fuck you, I have to fight Fedos. Fine. Fine, I'll teach you guys another goddamn lesson, because you never get through here. I can never get tired of just seeing them absolutely destroyed through my artillery and my skirmishers, but man, I really want them to stop. At least you guys made it easy this time. So two-thirds of their army were able to be eliminated. The priest didn't get as many kills as usual, but hey, thankfully they finally broke. So now, hopefully they'll let me get through the turn end, and we can continue trying to hunt down their family members with Aachen. Because he should have enough movement, as long as that general didn't go far. I'm at least killing the air. If he did go too far, I might have enough movement to still get to him. It depends on where he goes. They do have quite a bit of movement. So that should be it for the assaults, at least from the stallion. God damn it. I need to shut up so they don't I don't jinx it. Okay, now the question is. So let's first check on Estalia. Uh, more time. Yeah, I know you guys are pissed. That's fine. Um, down here, so that's by. Uh, so, oh, okay, he's closer, actually. Yeah, okay, so he's right there. You also keep trying to keep an eye on him. Because I want you to just... Oh, didn't mean to do that, but it's fine. Just kind of, again, do the same thing. <laughs> just in case. Because he's right there, faction there. I should have been able to get to him. Yeah, I do. Okay, so right here. Oh, this is going to be a bridge battle. <laughs> oh, this is going to be a bridge battle. A bridge battle with giants. Interesting. Um... <laughs> Well, I'm just going to rush across with my giants and uh, see if they blob up or not. If they do, oh, this should be over quickly. So we'll kill this guy. Uh, I think it's a turn or two to get back over to where their faction leader is right now. Uh, if he's still around the same spot. Oh, actually, I almost have Nephrodus hand in a bodyguard, too. Okay, first let you guys do your business. Then I can have everybody else do theirs. So let's get everybody else in behind them. Let them just freely shoot them all. Let's back up. Start the battle, and then unload. Oh, come on, run across. Run across. Oh, no, you're not running across. They're actually shooting us. They're returning fire. Okay, pull back. Are they going to run across now? No, they're not. Damn. 
Okay, I can move a little bit closer and still hit them. No, okay, I can't. Okay, giants just rush on forward. Uh, the captain, the general, is this one right here. Yeah, I believe it's... Yeah, here he is. There's the faction leader. Or faction here. So, just rush across there. Try and convince them to run across to try and face us. So that my um, Nephrod's bodyguard can actually destroy them. So, focus them down. Number one, 16%. They haven't crossed just yet. I'll move you guys a little bit closer. Although, these are skirmishers right here. Finish them off, and then you can maybe kind of get some better shots on some of their infantry, possibly. Maybe not. Giants, where'd he go? Oh, he's, no, he's still fighting, you guys. He's at 45 men. He'll be dead any second now. If I was handy in bodyguard, I think I'm going to pull you back around. Let's send them the chariots. Uh, oh, actually, these are spearmen. Yeah, just fucking throw them in there as well. Might as well throw them in there. I honestly don't care too much about my chariots. I'd actually rather place them with some other unit. There goes the prince. So faction leader, faction heir is not dead. Giants spread out and start causing some more damage to everybody else now. That our main target has been finished. I'm going to send in all of my general's bodyguard units as well. Start fighting them. The general's dead, so it should not take that long for them to start breaking. Yeah, they're now at 68%. There's just a couple stragglers left, so I'm gonna give my chariots AI commands at this point. Same with my giants for the most part, and just finish them off. Okay, there we go. So now, I just need to kill, hopefully, hopefully just that other faction leader I found. Uh, we have to go see where he is, see if he's still in that same spot next to Karak Izor. If he is, I think it is a turn or two until I can get there by foot. As long as he's still right around there, maybe he would move, move closer to us. The air did, so maybe he did as well. Because, come on, please do that. I would so appreciate it. So, he is still over there. Jesus. I wish Bertone could kill him. Where is, actually, where is, uh, because... You're, okay, you're sitting in the same spot. That's good. The Bretonian general is staying in the same exact spot. So, we gash. A way for me to get past that without accidentally hitting that city. Uh, I could go down around this way, which I think I'm gonna try and do that. I don't want to get stuck. Let's go this way. I do not think so. Around there. My thirst there. drives me. Yeah, because I don't want. I'd, I'd be easily get stuck around. The I so we'll go around this way. And we just need to get to you. So I need darkness, like another turn or two to be able to get to you. I Unless I can just get really lucky with you. Nope, I can't get that lucky. Okay, same thing. I need you to just stay around here and then just do the same thing, just to make sure I always know where he is. Same with you. Although I don't think he's going to move. So, so just stay around there just to make sure that you keep an eye on him. Now, Arkin, the best way to get there... Yeah, I think going back this way. Make your whip there. I do have an assassin. So I can try and bring you on up here to try and stab him. 21% chance! 21% chance there. And didn't I have another assassin up here? I thought I did. I guess not. Um, let's have you repair everything. And then I'll try and retrain this stuff later. So there you go. I thought I had another assassin. Oh no, here's one. Okay, so go up there. You got a 5% chance. I might as well send maybe some of these other ones. Or at least, um... You. You are a good one, so I'll try and send you up this way. 10% chance. Yeah, try and make your way over there. Announce we know siege, that's fine. Fashion announcement. Yeah, you guys assassinated my dudes. I hate you. Please don't. That's my game. Uh... Oh, the Norskins are not liking me. Oh, that's not good for us. Okay, Templehof. Let's see. I should go to Waldenorf. Waldenhof. Let's leave behind, like, one of you. Or actually, I can just, like, bring one unit over here. Bring that over there. Um, I can't get to Waldenhof just yet. Just sit on the bridge for now. Go wait in Templehof. Um, oh, yeah, I can't, do have a bunch of mercenaries right here. Uh, let's just go grab all of you. Send them back. I'll just grab some fresh ones for Neferata. You'll be making your way over to Waldenhof. Uh, up and Silver Pinnacle. Uh, three turns for all of those units. I need some more Neferata's handmade bodyguard, too. So I'll start trying to recruit some of them. 
and I do have these Lich Priests. I'm gonna need you for sure for when we set up the defense. So I've got actually four extra slots there. Um, I'll probably replace some of these fodder units because I can send some of you back over there. Keep gathering these together. So that gives me about eight slots. Um, that'd be five right there, and these three at least. Yeah, that works perfectly. So we'll grab all those units. That'll be the force we'll use to try and push back the goddamn chaos forces. Okay, that one I might be able to actually win against. Maybe... probably not. But hopefully I can just at least push them back up to here, set up a fort, and if I have the Lich Priest there, I should be able to very easily defend that city for now. But that's just gonna take some time to get that army together, like... How many turns? It's at least... this takes seven turns to recruit. Um... let's switch that out. Let's switch you to there and there. That way, you'll f these three you'll finish, and then you'll be recruiting those at the same time. That should work perfectly, Mortals and it'll take another just me. one, two, no, three more turns for these ones as well. I'm just gonna let them take it. I'm just gonna let them take it. I'm making my army that's gonna be coming back to reclaim it anyways, and I'd rather just focus on that because I, right now, the main goal is for me to try and focus on the Bretonians and the Estallians. The Chaos Warriors, I'm not too worried about. I'm gathering a force together, and as long as I actually put them all over here, I can push them back. But awaits. I want to kill Bretonia or Estalia today. They're so fucking close. And same thing here. If I'm going to just win it... Okay. Um, if I'm going to kill them off, I mean, sorry. If I'm going to kill them off with um, focusing on their family members, I don't care if I lose these little cities right here. So... I'm just going to keep focusing on getting Arkin into place. Hopefully he's not going to be interrupted. Because Arkin might be able to get there in time? I really hope their general starts trying to move to the west. Because otherwise they might decide to attack me. And try and prevent me from pushing forward. And my army can do quite a bit of damage with my giants. But I'm really hoping they'll just leave me alone. Let's see. Let's go back over here. He's still here. I will defeat you honorably, Nobody else in there? No. I do have this assassin. Can you maybe assassinate him 5% chance? Because you had that one. Where'd the other guy go? I had another assassin that was trying to make their way over here. Uh, it was you. Keep trying to go over there and assassinate him. 18% chance here. Please stop being stuck. Go there. Okay. Next turn you can try and get there. Um, that one army might get in the way. Let's try and walk. Nothing yep, you're gonna get in the way. Uh, can you just get out of my way? The me. Okay, I got lucky. I got very lucky that none of the giants took damage. Okay, so actually, well done. Uh, this army is still in the way. It will run. Okay, good. And I can keep making. Get the fuck out of my way, please. I'm just trying to get through here, and I don't want you interrupting me. Because this army's got, like, what, just a couple infantry units? I don't even have enough movement to get there, then. Is there anybody in Putrid Stomp? Just a general. Okay, so there's just a general over there, so I don't have to worry. Ah, oh, shit, where'd he go? Some shit. people just crave attention. The thirst overwhelms me. I can maybe get there. So he's over here right now. Oh, no, not from this angle. Um... Okay, I think I have to. Okay, I have to go this way. Can you move? Ah, you fucking bastard! You really want to fight me here? Fine. We'll have to kill him with Nagash. Then, if I can just get, hopefully, hopefully, the Bretonian general will stay where he is, and I can get to him next turn and kill him. That's the hope. That's the hope. Just had to get rid of this little damn army. Hello, hello. Nephron's handmaid bodyguard, please unload on them. Have you go there, giants, group on up right here, and then everybody else kind of back on up. Start the battle. Please murder, murder him immediately. Come on, run across. Run across the map, the bridge, please. Let's see, 16%, 20% of the force is already dead. Keep that up. Just soften them up so it's a bit easier for my giants to finish them off. I would love if you guys actually try and cross the map, though. Oh, there you go. Oh, yeah, that's exactly the one. Right there. 60%, 65%. Almost out of ammo. And they're out of ammo. Okay. So we were able to take out about two-thirds of the army before they even crossed. And now, let's get my giants to make their way on over here. And where is the captain? He's the pistolier. Oh, he's the circle knights. 
rushing over there. I'll have some of you just kind of split off other units. Because there's not that many of them left at this point. They already lost three-fourths of their army. Just kind of rushing over. I'll bring these units in here, too. Okay, there we go. That asshole. Get out of my way, Hugo. Now, keep pushing. I hate that the Norskins have Altdorf. If they didn't have Altdorf, and I could maybe easily just take Altdorf, I would probably just try and do that, maybe. But no, for now, this is what we're going to do. Just don't move the Bretonian Joe. I should have enough movement, if he doesn't move, to kill him next turn. And ideally, that's all we need to do with this army here. Hopefully, that will be the end of Bretonia. Right, he's going on a fucking adventure round here with our... Uh, so keep moving around here. Make your way over there. Have another chance with the assassin. Of course not. Okay, again, keep an eye on him, just in case he moves. If he moves... Like, if he moves up here, I can maybe get to him. Oh my god, can you guys just leave me the fuck alone? I don't care about you. I don't care about you whatsoever. This one rebel settlement is not that important to me in the grand scheme of things, so fuck off, please. Sure, I'll accept my troops back. Like, I don't know why you guys are so gung-ho about trying to just kill my armies. Oh, please let me get out of here. I don't want to fight this. This is what I was worried about. I don't want to fight you guys right now. I know we can win this. I know we can win this. But I don't want to fight this right now because it'll just wait way too long. So, I think I'll just end this video for now here. I don't want to. I want to end. I want to kill Tony in the test out. They're so fucking close. But, we'll do that next video. Next video, they all die. I hope. But, I'm going to end this video for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this. If you guys uh, did, let me know down in the comments down below. I love hearing what you guys have to say about this campaign. Any thoughts you have on it in general. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this. This is Rampan. I'll see you guys next time.